always cheer me, Lord. I know a woman who keeps buying puzzles. Chinese puzzles, blocks, wires, pieces that finally fit into some order. She works it out mathematically. She solves all her puzzles, lives down by the sea, puts sugar out for the ants, and believes ultimately in a better world. Her hair is white. She seldom combs it. Her teeth are snaggled, and she wears loose, shapeless coveralls over a body most women would wish they had. For many years, she irritated me with what I considered her eccentricities, like soaking eggshells in water to feed the plants so that they would get calcium. But finally, when I think of her life and compare it to all the other lives, more dazzling, original, and beautiful, I realize that she has hurt fewer people than anybody I know, and by hurt, I simply mean hurt. She has had some terrible times, times when maybe I should have helped her more, for she is the mother of my only child. And we were once great lovers, but she has come through life like I said. She has hurt fewer people than anybody I know. And if you look at it like that, well, she has created a better world. She is one. Francis, this poem is for you.